let us see a problem on a multi-fluid manometer. Here is the example. The water in a tank is pressurized by air. Here there is air and which is applying pressure on water. Uh, is measured by manometric uh, uh, multi-fluid manometer. The tank is located on a mountain at an altitude of 1400 meter where the atmospheric pressure is 85.6 kilopascal. So here the pressure is given as atmospheric pressure atmospheric pressure is given as 85.6 kilopascal determine the air pressure in the tank if h1 is 0 0.1 meter this h1 is 0 0.1 meter 0 0.1 meter and h2 is 0 0.2 meter and h3 is 0 0.35 meter so all the heights are given take the densities of water oil and mercury to be density of water is equal to 1000 kg per meter cube and the density of oil is 850 kg per meter cube density of mercury is 13600 kg per meter cube so what do we need to find so we need to find the pressure of this air so we need to find this pressure so what is the pressure here there is 0.1 so the uh, uh, air pressure is P1 I am going deep into this as I go deep into this we need to add rho gh now P1 is the pressure of air plus uh, I go until here so that I can jump to the surface so this is also water so P1 plus rho water g how much height uh, uh, how much depth did I go it is h1 and from here again I am going upside or I can jump directly to here uh, if I jump directly to here because this is oil surface and this is also oil so I can jump from here to here and then I am going down so plus rho oil g and this height is h2 up to h2 I have gone and from here to here uh, I am jumping and uh, I am going upside so minus rho this is mercury rho mg and uh, h3 h3 and here there will be atmospheric pressure acting so minus p atmospheric pressure is equal to 0 and now we need to just substitute these values so p1 we need to find that and uh, rho w density of water is 1000 kg per meter cube into 9.81 is a uh, acceleration due to gravity and h1 is 0 0.1 meter plus oil density is 850 into acceleration due to gravity 9.81 into h2 h2 is 0 0.2 and the next it is minus rho m which is 13600 into 9.81 into h3 h3 value is 0.35 minus atmospheric pressure 85.6 kilopascal into 10 power 3 is pascals so 85.6 into 10 power 3 pascals so as this, as these values are in uh, pascal we need to represent p atmospheric pressure uh, in pascals only so if you solve this you will be getting 130 kilopascal once check whether it is right or wrong it is 130 kilopascal so this is the simple uh, way of doing these problems if we go deep into it add rho gh if we go upside then subtract rho gh that's it